Welcome back to another set of tips and tricks. And today I'm going to show you how to put a ferrite choke if you're trying to kill RF or electrical noise that's generated from electrical device on your boat like your trolling motor onto your transducer cable. This is the transducer here. First thing you'll need to do is uncoil about two foot of cable. What you need to do is take your choke, run your cable, and they're about two foot. The recommendation is to do six wraps, so you'll want to wrap that in there. And what you'll need to do is wrap these pretty tight, because to get six wraps is going to take quite a bit of work to get it through here. The more wraps you can do, the better your odds of killing all the RF noise. There's three. There's four. There's five. And you can see our holes getting pretty small, but you can get it through there. The more times you can get it through here, the better. We're going to see if we can get one more. Yep. I don't think we can get any more through that hole, so we're going to attempt. I think we can. There we go. Now what you want to do is spread that, keep those circles small. And I like to get the centers in there and just fan it out like that. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven loops. Plug that into your unit and that should kill your electrical noise. I uh, hope that helps you understand how to install a ferrite choke on your transducer cable. Uh, tune in next time to another set of tips and tricks. Thank you.